Hello everybody. In this video, we going to check the ESP module and also upload the firmware. Let's get started with this. I'm going to check this module and upload the firmware. The other side, it is like this. Let's connect this one to the FTDI. I'm using this FTDI to program, make sure this jumper is the other side, 3.3 volt side. The wiring diagram is here. This 8 pins are here. Make sure the jumper in this side. I have connect this module to the breadboard like this. I got 8 wires here. The FTDI is here. Now I am going to plug this one to the breadboard. Now I have connected the corresponding wire and also we connect the enable pin to VCC 3.3 volt. First we check the module. I use cool term. You can use any terminal. Uh, I have shown a separate video how to install cool term. It's available here in this time. Uh, click option. Uh, select the port and change it to 115200. Okay. Click connect. Connected. Now we type AT and enter and you get OK. So that means this one is working and uh, we type AT plus GMR enter. The version is here. So I have another module. It, it doesn't work. It doesn't have the proper firmware. I disconnect this one and uh, I change them. I change the other module. I, I swap this one to this module and now we connect and uh, we type AT it doesn't work now I cut the power and uh, give the power again now some garbage is coming so I going to install the firmware for this module so I disconnect and uh, go to the web browser and I'm going to do the uh, download the flash download tool from this website. I give the link in the description below and go to support and uh, tools. Again, go to support tools and flash download tools. We download this one, it's downloading for the firmware uh, in the I think a website we download we select document and go below and Wi-Fi module series ESP8266 series go below and various AT firmware and bottom factory default AT firmware we download this one is uh, 2017 November 30 and it's downloaded now we go to download folder uh, first uh, the firmware we extract this is the way I extract for the we select the 8 mbit one and copy the bin file and go to download folder here we paste it so it's extracted we extract this one flash download tool and extract all extract now right click this one run as administrator more info run anyway and there's a icon here flash this one and click yes Okay, we bring it here. Uh, we click this button and uh, select the firmware open. And here we put 0x00000 and we tick this one. We keep, keep as it is and then we change the wire to upload the firmware we need to connect these two pins flash and rst to ground like this and this one 
now we can upload after connecting select the correct com port and make this one to 961200 and click start now we see the dot here now we remove the reset wire from ground at this point we need to remove this wire like this remove this one now it's uploading when this one finish we get send flash finish now we remove the flash wire also from the ground now we remove the flash wire also like this this one remove also the flash remove now we go to pull term and uh, connect when type at it doesn't work now we remove the power wire and give the power again one more time now we give the reset wire to the ground and remove it now connect the rst to ground and remove it like this and remove it now it's ready now we can type at enter now type at at plus gmr now it's failed now we need to connect it again at plus gmr and uh, enter now we get the correct term there thank you very much for watching if you have any question write down in the comment section below i try to answer as much as i can thank you bye